We just read a lot of books. I read, I read a lot of books too. Books in the library, and books falling from this vending machine. i never seen one of them before. There's a reason. Did you know that you're the first school in Buffalo to have one? How cool is that? It's really cool. It is. It's just super cool. The Inchy the Bookworm vending machine made its way into Buffalo Public School 61 back in November, saying it's been successful would be an understatement. And we received some positive phone calls from parents about how they're reading and engaging with their kids. Earning gold coins, making reading a reward. We got down two books. So how does a student earn the opportunity to use the book vetting machine? Well, they could show good character traits or they could be part of the principal's reading club. And the gold coin looks like this. Instead of getting a video game, getting candy, getting, but they're getting a book. So the child is learning the value of, of getting a book and how important that is. These book vending machines are made local in Amherst. Jason Blumberg is the mastermind behind the reading revolution, who's made it his goal to curb Buffalo's low literacy rates. This is the biggest thing that I've ever, ever been involved with, and it's way more important than the vending machines. Has this helped your love for reading? Yes, a lot, because we get to pick out whatever book we want. Just put in a code, you get what book you want. The vending machines are now being purchased by districts across the country. And here at School 61, they're filled with books written by local authors and picked to serve a purpose. Books that are designed to help kids to um, make changes to their character. Or designed to bring a smile to a child's face. I pick a worm book after an adventure book. A what kind of book? A worm book. A worm book? I love worms. They're so cute. Sean Robson. Yeah, they are. 7 Eyewitness News.